Hi and welcome to another episode of Tech Tips. My name is Tech Bashi and today what we're going to do is we're going to discuss how to use the NVMS 1000 PC software on your laptop or PC uh, to connect to the Wish series of NVRs and the LTDVR SE recorders. In today's demonstration, we're going to show you the software running on a PC. So the software I'll be using is NVMS 1000. For Mac users out there, the process is exactly the same. The difference is the software you'll be using is NVMS 1200. So to start with this demonstration, what we need to do is make sure that you've installed the NVMS software on the PC. So once it's installed, you run the software, it's a small icon that looks like a picture of a camera. It will normally ask you to log in or create a user account. Once you've created a user account, you can automatically, you can check, check a box that will make it automatically load that account every time the software starts. Just to make it a little bit quicker when the software is loading. Okay, so once this control panel opens up, the first thing you need to do is you need to go to create a device, which you'll find under the device tab on the software. So once you select that, you'll get the option to choose whether or not it's an IP camera or a DVR. Now the DVR basically means NVR as well. Okay, so once you're, once you're there, you've got another option. You can either put the details in, or i.e. the IP address of the machine that you wish or device you wish to connect to uh, in the uh, box for the IP address, uh, port number, username and password, or you can use the embedded search tool that's built into the software that will allow you to search out devices uh, that will work with this software. So for convenience, I'll select that option. Now, once you see a list of devices appear on here, choose the one that you require. Once you highlight that, select OK. All you need to do now is you need to put the username and password into the correct location. Now the password is going to be the password for the DVR, not the password for the software. In this instance, it's 123456, which is the default password for this range of NVRs. Now underneath that is an area for selecting the area that you wish to have the DVR reside. If you haven't got an area in that box, you need to create one. So what I'll do is I'll select create new area and I'll just call it any area for now. Select OK. Once you've done that, it will come up in that box. If you don't create that, it won't allow you to add the NVR or DVR or IP camera. Now underneath that option or underneath that area, you've got the option to check or uncheck a box that says upload bandwidth more than to meg. So if you're on a very, very uh, slow network uh, where you've got a very, very slow upload bandwidth, you can tick that box to make it use less speed on the network. So once you've done that, select OK. Once you've added the device, to go to the live preview, select the option that says live preview. You'll now be presented with the multi-screen layout and if you double click the area that we created, any area, it should load the camera feeds. You have the option to view a single channel, four channels, a nine way split, 16 way, 25, 36, and basically anything up to a maximum of 100. And that's pretty much all you need to do in order to get the NVR or DVR or IP camera uh, working with the NVMS 1000 software. Now, like I said earlier, it's exactly the same for the NVMS 1200 software for the iMacs or the Apple Mac machines. Um, so that's about it. So if there's any help or anything you require in terms of help, give us a call on 01707 330541 or get on our website at www.gnecctv.com. See you again soon.